My name is Brett, and I'm a product manager on Blogger. Okay, why should people choose Blogger over WordPress? That is a great question. Um, so Blogger is a platform that lets you publish your voice on the web in a very, very easy way. Um, and we've also made it a very powerful platform, so there's lots of advanced features. So right now, um, it's a platform that designers who care about the appearance of their blog um, can feel proud to use, so the sites are look uh, very sophisticated, and they have powerful features that let you track the traffic data, the analytics, um, comment protection, spam controls, all these powerful features that, again, are very easy to use. So we're catering to the people who have never used Blogger before and they want a very easy uh, way to publish your voice. But at the same time, we have powerful features that will let you, uh, you know, create a good-looking uh, piece of content on the web. So we're easy, we're free, and we're powerful. Is there anything new we should be expecting from Blogger? Yes, that's a good question. So right now we're in the process of overhauling the entire UI. Um, right now the app itself looks a little bit dated, uh, but within the next couple months we'll have a totally new UI. It'll be a code refresh, so it'll be faster, sleeker, more reliable, um, and it'll look like a modern web app. So that's kind of the pitch right there. Okay, anything else you want to say? Um, come by and get a t-shirt at the Blogger booth. We're having a lot of fun with the Twitter. Awesome. Thank you. My name is Jane Wells, and I am the user experience lead for WordPress. Okay, so the question is, why should people choose WordPress over Blogger? I used to use Blogger. I started out on Blogger, so I sometimes don't say people should. I'm sorry, it's a little loud here. Uh, I, they Maybe they shouldn't. Uh, if Blogger is doing what they need it to do, then they're happy, then I think they should stay with it. <laughs> WordPress I like because it's open source, and I think that it moves forward faster. There's an amazing community, hundreds of developers working on the code, over 35 million users of the software, and it's being extended in ways we could never have imagined by plugin and theme developers, and so I think that open source really has a lot of benefits when it comes to moving forward with software. That blogger, even though I think Google is amazing, and I know the original blogger team, and they're amazing, they just can't move at the same speed because they don't have the number of contributors and the open architectures that really leads to innovation. And what's in store for WordPress in the future? What's in store for it? Uh, we'll keep making it better and we'll add some more cool stuff. We're going to be doing, I think the next release is going to be mostly performance enhancements and focusing on making it easier to update. Um, at some point we'll be doing an overhaul of the media uploading system. Yeah, it's just, we do a little bit every time and we release a few times a year so that we can just keep making it better. People don't have to wait three years in between redesigns to get um, releases to get new features. Like if they're ready, then they should be able to start using them. They shouldn't have to wait for us to build 20 features. Like let's just roll it out so we can start using the cool stuff right away. Oh, well, anything else you want to add? Uh, open source pays. Uh, That's it. Well, yeah, thank you. Thank you for your time. You're welcome.